now to the dangerous and deadly storms on the roads and on the tarmac tonight. The NTSB on the scene here in New York after a Delta passenger jet making a landing could not stop on a very slick runway. Crashing through that fence, the nose of the plane breaking through, coming to a halt just feet from the icy water. This image taken by a passenger inside the plane looking out how close they came to that water. Moments later, the crew with fuel leaking, getting passengers off the plane, coming down the wing, standing out in the snow. There were also deadly accidents today. Drivers stranded for miles, some up to 16 hours. We have team coverage on this tonight, and we'll get to it all in a moment. But first, ABC's Gio Benitez on the scene at LaGuardia Airport here in New York. Sorry, you have an aircraft off 31 on the North Vehicle Service Road. Please advise crash rescue. LaGuardia Airport is closed at this time. Close calls don't come much closer than this. That Delta plane from Atlanta with 132 people on board crashing right through a fence off LaGuardia's runway, a few feet from those icy waters. I just survived this. Passengers scrambling to get out. The emergency chutes not deployed. People having to slide off the plane's wing to safety. The other wing damaged and leaking fuel. From inside the plane, passengers could see the bay. Too close for comfort. When I looked out the window, the left wing was gliding across the fence that was holding the water back. When did you realize something was wrong? As soon as as soon as we hit when you, when you as hit soon as we hit the ground, it was going way too fast to be landing. The harrowing landing began at LaGuardia this morning at 11:05 with freezing fog and snow touching down but skidding seconds later. The plane veering left, driving over a snowbank and slamming into the barrier. And in the distance you can see the nose of that plane right there through the fence and from this vantage point you can just see how much water that plane missed. Just minutes before the terrifying skid, two planes landed, reporting they had no problems breaking on a runway that had just been plowed. One of the puzzling elements here is why the airplane veered off the runway when they still had quite a bit of runway ahead of them. And that would indicate that maybe another malfunction took place that we haven't considered. More than two dozen people suffered minor injuries. Five people, like this man, Are you okay? carried off to the hospital on stretchers. None of the injuries life-threatening. The runway shut down for most of the afternoon as the cleanup and the investigation begin. And Gio Benitez with us live now from LaGuardia Airport. Gio, you reported there that a couple of planes had landed just before this plane. That's right, David. Those two planes landing safely in those same bad conditions. And that's why investigators are here right now to piece this all together. That kind of landing is what so many passengers uh, worry about. Gio, thank you.